Now the Yale starting five. Azar Swain is their leading scorer. He's coming off a 24-point night as Bruner gets stymied inside. Look at this Yale team. They start all five upperclassmen, juniors and seniors. They lost three starters last year, and to be able to replace them, actually four starters last year, your top three scores, your leading rebounder, and it, they knew they were going to have some overhaul on the roster. Guard is the most important position on their team, and to have a freshman, and Alamir Dawes is a very, very good player. Like I said, he's had great moments for them this year, but he's just a freshman, yep. and unfortunately, there's going to be some growing pains with that, but... Tigers 0 for 5 from 3. Let's move on the baseline. How about the up and under there by Jalen Gabadon, who has four. Jordan Bruner, the rebound, will head man the break. Yeah, good luck there from Sims, though. Still got it on the block. Tough shot there by Jordan Bruner, but that's what he could do. It always is best time of the year in my book. Tyson, the deep three from international waters. So the Bulldogs remaining feisty on the defensive nice. end. Bruner to Atkinson and the N1 scored a field goal in the last 4.43. Oh, good. Come on, Atkinson. Atkinson. How about running the break, Jordan Bruner? Could have beat Penn State earlier this year. I mean, they didn't, so you can't really say anything. That's problematic. Turnover and the dunk by Tyson. And That's a great rule. You know, it's a team obviously should be rewarded for getting an offense free about the 30 seconds is just too long. What a pass by Atkinson to Bruner. Like they can't ask for a better look from Amir Sims. Did a good job of getting him his team another possession. What a block on the weak side by Jordan Bruner. Atkinson to Bruner. Oh, he got it. What a way to finish for Jordan Bruner from down the road. And they will kill the clock and end this ball game. First time they played in 18 years and a memorable outcome. Last time they played Yale won. This time, Yale with a victory.